Hey there, I'm Amber Brook, checking things out at Gwinnett Tech for TechHead TV. Gwinnett Tech offers hundreds of programs. Today we'll be visiting commercial photography. It's college, TechHead style. Yeah. In this day and age, we'd all like to think we know how to take a picture. I mean, it's just point and shoot, right? Well, looking at these amazing photos, I'm realizing that's not really the case. So, to find out what it takes, we're spending the day with Program Director of Commercial Photography, Kim Harkins. Let's go find out what she's up to. Hi, Kim. Hi, Amber. How are you today? Good, thank you. Thanks for coming in. Oh, definitely. Thanks for having me. What, what are you guys doing in here? Well, this is our holiday portrait set, and we do this once a year in our advanced portraiture class where our students create a set, design it, create a set, build it, and then they do advertising to bring people in to get their portraits taken. We burn it to a CD and um, it's just a really exciting time, but it, the real idea behind this is it teaches the students how to do high quality volume portraiture. That's wonderful. So uh, tell me a little bit more about your commercial photography program. Yeah, the program's two years long. Mm -hmm. uh, you have an option of getting a certificate in photo imaging diploma or a degree, associate degree. So they learn, you know, business practices, they learn how to do portraits, they learn how to get their book done. And in the real world, we're actually going into a, a gallery run by people who are curators and the students learn that next level. You know, this is my work, where is it going to hang? Right. And so it's exciting. This is a great set. Can I Absolutely. We're ready to have your picture taken. Yeah, yeah. All okay, right. Great. Why did you choose Gwinnett Technical College? Um, I chose Gwinnett Technical because it's, it's a really good program. I was first at a four-year state school for photography and I transferred here because it was um, taught me more about photography and how to get a job in photography, which is what I really want to do, right. is have a full-time career. And um, I've learned so much and it's been a really great move. I'm very happy that I did it. Overall, I mean, I recommend the program to everybody I see that says they're interested in photography. I, I recommend it to everybody I see. All right. Amanda's going to put you in our set. All get right. A nice photograph of you. In here, all right. So tell me about this camera. It looks different than cameras I usually see. Well, this definitely is a different camera. This is a film camera. This is a, actually a 4x5 camera. Um, and so what we're going to do today is shoot you with both film and digital. So you can see both results. And this is actually a camera that shoots one piece of film at a time. And we'll actually go in the dark room and you can see that. And let's have you just kind of lean in, and that's wonderful, great, nice. So we're shooting one sheet at a time here, so we're going to pull our slide, and that looks great. It's lovely, wonderful, nice, nice picture. Perfect. I definitely blinked that. <laughs> we can do another one, that's great. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to take this out, and we're going to actually process our negative. All right. And from that, we'll be able to have a negative and see exactly what your picture looks like. Right. So as we do that and we pull it out and we have this great negative. <gasps> cool. Okay, very nice. So why keep the old technology as part of the program? Well the old technology really helps students understand Photoshop better. They're going to learn from the traditional uh, negative and, and going into print how to dodge and burn, how to go in and fix things, because that's pretty much what a lot of people think Photoshop is all about, and it's certainly much more than that. But if you know how to do it in this technology, it's just a simple fix once we go into um, digital. And, and then certainly there is nothing more exciting than watching the image come up. Right. It's different uh, in a digital aspect. So this is the film process, the development process. So, so what's the other one? Can you show me the other one? Let's go to the digital lab. All right, great. So why did you choose Gwinnett Technical College in the first place? I didn't want to go to a university where there's not really a strong photography program. I heard a lot of good things from friends um, that were graduates of the school, so I decided to go, and it was way more than you could ever ask for in a program. And the fact that I didn't come out of school with debt is even better, right. so yeah. <laughs> So what percentage is taking the photo as opposed to editing the photo? Well, the students spend a lot of time uh, editing their images. Hopefully they spend 
the time just getting it ready to print instead of just um, trying to fix things we should have taken care of. So that's right. the whole idea is we're teaching them how to shoot it right and uh, we can get it on that image. So once this is ready to go, what happens? She's cropped it. Um, I think she went in, she made it a little tighter. Um, it was a little bit dark, so I think she went into exposure. And, and she lightened it a little bit. Now, now you have your Christmas card. Yay, so <laughs> perfect. <do> <laughs> and, um, and then what we'll do now is we'll go and print it. All right, so tell me, what have you been doing since your time here at Gwinnett Technical College? Um, when I first graduated from the school, I ended up getting a job at my internship. So I worked in a commercial studio, shooting everything from Piggly Wiggly to Riches, um, service merchandise and things like that. From there, I went to work for the camera manufacturer and worked for them for a couple of years and then started my own business about eight years ago. What does it mean to hang? Well, it's, it's kind of like the big uh, crescendo at the very end. It's, uh, it's what everybody looks forward to. It's uh, you get to see your work as well as everybody else gets to see your work. Not only your family, but there are also other local major photographers as well. So it's, qu it's quite an accomplishment. Well, here's your photograph. Thank you. These are great. I will never look at a photo the same way again, seriously. Great. Well, thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank you so much for showing me around. I really appreciate Sorry, it. My pleasure. Every time I visit a new program, I'm reminded at how much Gwinnett Technical College has to offer its students. Well, that's all for now. I'm Amber Brooke with TechEd TV, and we'll see you next time. Get alive.